What kind of teammate is Jimmy? I loved him. Like, that was my rookie. We played one-on-one all the time. He's the only time. Like, so I was coming to the end of my career, and Thibodeau was my boy, right? And I, I, me and Tibbs, we talk all the time, and we're chopping it up. I went to his office, and I said, I don't understand. Like, you got to explain this one to me. The world then goes out of the game, and we had this stretch where we had, like, the Knicks, and he guarded – Jimmy Butler guarded Carmelo Anthony. Then we played the Heat, and he guarded D-Wade and LeBron James. And this was a rookie, and he was not backing down. And I'm like – so we get back, and Lou Dane comes back, and Jimmy Butler goes down to five, seven, nine minutes, whatever it was, right? And I had to go to the office. And I wasn't trying to call out Thibodeau. I, I wasn't. I just wanted to know what his thought process was. I just watched this rookie like stare. So three of the, those guys at the time were probably the three best, like scoring, wing, like like tough covers in the NBA. Big, strong, physical wing players. And Jimmy Butler held his own, and he got like I, and he was thriving in that environment. And one thing Thibodeau did was I said this on radio to a Chicago station. Um, one thing he did was lay into me about Jimmy Butler. Um, you can't give any bulletin board material to uh, LeBron, D-Wade, uh, Carmelo Anthony, which he was right. I'm saying a rookie's coming in and not batting an eye at these three superstars. I said that on radio. So he told me, don't do that again. All right, fine, respect. But then he's like, I just got a long-term process for w- when it comes to Butler. You got to give him something. You got to take it away. You got to keep giving. And then eventually you build that mental toughness up. And I, I, whether I agree or disagree with the philosophy you know, like Jimmy Butler turned into like a, a really great player and that edge that he had, people didn't talk about it because he was he wasn't getting like the time that he like most rookies young players would deserve, you know, like go in there and play defense at the clip that he did. Another thing he does, he works on his body. Like he is constantly lifting and, and he and all that work ethic that you see from him now at four thirty AM workouts. And he maybe wasn't doing the four thirty workouts at that time, but uh, you could tell that he was a worker, and he, uh, he, it meant a lot to him. And being competitive was a lot to him. And then we played it one-on-one a ton, and, and uh, he was about it, man. Like, some guys were about competition, and some guys just want to live the lifestyle. Jimmy Butler's about competition.